If you're looking at a 3D map, the Ordnance Survey are very well positioned to provide the information and data required to produce what we call a digital twin of the real world. One of the reasons Bournemouth was chosen is the lay of the land is representative um, within a small area of the vast area that eventually this would have to cover. Ordnance Survey's role working with Bournemouth uh, Borough Council and the Met Office is to model uh, how 5G is going to work, how we can successfully introduce it throughout the United Kingdom. So the task is to map part of the Bournemouth area to enable us to look at positioning new aerials for 5G technologies to try and identify the best places to deploy these as quickly and effectively as possible. These signals which we're talking about, they're very, very high frequency. And high frequency signals are affected by very small items. So it's important to know where those small items are accurately. So things like tree canopies, weather, all affect the dissipation of the signal. And so it's really important that we understand the current built environment, but also the emerging built environment. What you can see on the screen is a red and green pattern. The red is showing where the aerial cannot see anything by line of sight. The green is showing where it can see things by line of sight. So by combining a number of aerials and seeing what their line of sight is, we can cover specific regions knowing that we've got full coverage for the 5G signal in that area. So precision is absolutely central to this uh, and Ordnance Survey has precision in its DNA. No longer is it good enough to say it's one or two metres away, it's got to be within centimetres, if not less. And with the Ordnance Survey data and our ability to survey at that level of detail, it puts us in an unprecedented situation to provide that level of detail for this work. I really do think the time of Ordnance Survey has come. Our obsession about precision and about millimetre accuracy is here. We're on the verge of something amazing. You know, the United Kingdom is an incredible place, but we are a brilliant country. And here is yet another example where we are about potentially to lead the world in, in 5G technology. Mm -hmm.